Hey there everyone and welcome back to Lost Eden. Yes, we're still playing and Adam is alive and kicking again because I loaded the game and here we are in Tamara at the Village Raptors. I, uh, I saved you the embarrassment that was me uh, <laughs> searching for them for the uh, another entire video again. So let's give them some gold and get this over with. Let's see if you can also understand Velociraptor Ring. They seem to appreciate your gift, but they'd rather be given objects of power. Yeah, and it, what do you mean rather? Because, you know, if we give only dead, they want gold. Ah, uh, capitalists, what are you gonna do about them? Here's your object of power, man. Go nuts. <laughs> He likes the object of power, Adam. He says the tyrant will tremble with horror. Yeah, uh, enjoy with the within without object of power. That's still a very weird name, I think. But whatever. So that's that done. And Eloy seems to be back. Because he did went uh, out to get some news again, of course. It's good to see you again, my lord. And apparently there was no news because then you get a uh, generic greeting like that. I believe if you actually leave before he uh, comes back and then he comes back, he actually uh, has a comment about sorry for keeping you waiting and such. Show me where you want to go. Yeah, let's go to uh, Uluru again. Uluru. Yeah, yeah, we know, we know. You're very happy to see everyone again. Such a family man at Eloy. So yeah, traveling back and forth is kind of annoying, I suppose. But, oh well, it's not too tedious at least. Back to the Ulelele uh, to get us uh, ourselves another object of power, which is, I believe, the Eye of the Cyclone, if I remember correctly. I'm pretty sure it was an eye, at least. The first object of power has been used. You may take a second one. Come back when you have found one of our masks. Which would be the final one. Yeah, just for j just humor me here. Uh, what is it called? This object of power is the eye in the cyclone. It sweeps the tyrant before it like dust. Okay, so I almost had it right. It's not of the cyclone, but in the cyclone. <laughs> Whatever. Close enough. Especially with my track record of uh, misnaming things. And Eloy is gone again. Oh boy. Well, let's try if we can force that uh, other sequence. We have to wait for Eloy. Yeah. Hopefully he'll come back soon. Oh, he comes back right away. Awesome. I have news. Okay, so when he has news, then he doesn't say uh, he's sorry, little prick. Fug was right. The Velociraptors at Tamara have defeated the Tyron Warband. Cool, so now that place is safe. There are Triceratops at Tamara. So we can uh, build that thing more over there. Actually, let's uh, let's check out this... Uh, this citadel over here. See how this uh, has grown since the last time we've uh, been here. So let's move one up and see how the citadel looks now. No, it's still the same. Okay, I thought the uh, Triceratops have uh, gone and made it bigger already. But not yet. Anyway guys, meet me back in the uh, Valley of 
Uh, Cantura? Well, we will give. Well, we will seek out the village traps and I'll meet you back there. So, see you there. Oh my god, finally I found them. I, I walked by them twice on the map. <laughs> it's really annoying that they move on the map because you can uh, just miss them like that. And yeah, twice. I've been all over the map like three times now. <laughs> I did also find a tyrant, so at least these are, those are on the map as well now. And uh, I look at the inventory and I totally forgot the gold. Damn it! Be right back again! Well, at least gold is easy to find, so uh, no real problem here. And they were on the map now, so... You know, we found them, let's give them the gold and lift it. let's get them a, the uh, optic of power, which is the cyclone in the... <laughs> not the cyclone, in the store, no... The eye in the cyclone. That's the word I wanted uh, to use. They seem to appreciate your gift, but they'd rather be given objects of power. The greedy bastard shouldn't complain. But whatever. Here. Go tear those damn tyrant up. He thanks you for giving him his favorite object of power. So, okay, that's all good and done. So, time to head out again. And now, what we need to do is go over all the valleys and go enlist the uh, help of the Triceratops, Triceratops in each one of them. Again, kind of tedious backtracking and doing them all, but whatever. What you're gonna do? You want to go. Let's, uh,. Head over to Shamar, shall we? Hold on! We'll be with Chong and the Shoryans in no time at all! We've seen this one, but we haven't seen them enter Shamar, so let's just check that out. Kinda weird. <laughs> kind of a combination they had uh, going on there. Well, oh well. Join me when uh, once I found the Triceratops again. See you there guys. And I do think we found them. Luckily these guys don't move so it take it doesn't take nearly as long as finding the uh, Philosoraptors. Yeah those legs don't look right at all. <laughs> <laughs> oh well, let's uh, give them a bird's nest. Whatever the hell they might be doing with that, I don't know, but whatever. And have Eve sing for them. Oh, my singing has rallied them. They say they're ready to help with the building. So that's Shamar pretty much done. Onwards we go, so let's move out to the next valley. Which was... Um, oh, and that's Eloy again, because he went off for... Uh, some more news, I suppose. I have news! Well, let's hear it. What good news do you have? The Velociraptors have won a victory at Kantura! Great! I saw Triceratops entering the valley at Kantura, my lord! A magnificent sight! So we can finish that place off as well. Yeah, we still have a while to go. No, I need to click here, not on the map. <laughs> so yeah, let's go to Koto. Show me where you want to go. Which is of course our favorite region for uh, obvious reasons. It won't take us long to reach Koto. It's always a pleasure to see Komala of the Kobu. Yes, Eloy states right there. <laughs> so let's head out. And yeah, I'm gonna show this scene again, uh, but 
I will see you guys back at the Triceratops. So see you there and enjoy this scene. And here we are at uh, the Triceratops in Koto, so let's give them a bird's nest and have Eve sing for them. And that means we'll be done here as well. Boy, this video is gonna be a lot of fun editing. <laughs> And she says the same exact thing as last time. Oh well. It makes that easy. So, uh, see you guys back over at, um, um, where should we go next? Kentura, I believe. Let's see if Eloy has any uh, new news. It's good to see you again, my lord. Nope, he does not. Oh well. Yeah, this video is gonna be fun editing. But uh, the whole LP is actually quite a chore to edit together. Because I need to uh, increase the audio each time when someone speaks. And, you know, Show doesn't say anything uh, they've already said before. Finding the balance there is kind of tedious. But, oh well, it's, it's all fun. So, no problem. Anyway, see you back at the uh, Triceratops in Cantura, guys. See you there. Here we come. Maybe you'll see Dina. And here we are in the Valley of Cantura at the Triceratops. And I did pick up some gold uh, on the way over here. And he's probably gonna say the same thing again, so we can probably skip that. Yep, so, uh, well, that's this valley done again. Uh, did I seriously pick up one bird's nest too many? <laughs> oh well. No problem, really. But it doesn't fit in the trash can. What did I just forget one valley? Hmm. Uh, oh, Elo is back again, so... Which one did I not do yet? Show me where you want to go. Did I do Tamara yet? I think I didn't, so... Uh, time to go over there. See you guys there. Alright, so that kind of made me feel stupid because I totally forgot Tamara. But uh, yeah, we're here and uh, here are the Triceratops, here's your bird nest. If, if you please, then we're done with all the valleys indeed. Awesome! Same thing again. So we can skip that. So uh, let's... Uh, Go back to the map and see if Eloy has uh, found any news of uh, uh, of interest for us. And he's back right away. Great. My lord, I bring grave tidings. Your father has died. Peacefully in his sleep. 
but it's imperative that you now return to Mo, where Counselor Monk awaits you. Oh boy. More drama. <laughs> yeah, another death. Oh boy. But that also means more story. And I don't really mind that in a game, so let's uh, head over to Mo. It's been a while, hasn't it? Show me where you want to go. And see what uh, we can do over there. So let's head out. The Citadel of Mo will soon be there. Well, I do hope so. Can't have bodies rot forever, you know. That that's kind of disgusting. So uh, yeah, let's. Uh, Let's see uh, Adam's old man off. And let's uh, meet Monk again. It's been a real long while since we've seen anything of his. And the king we will see no more, at, uh, unfortunately. Kinda like the king. But oh well. He was kinda old, I suppose. Yeah, now that's a real set citadel, not like those branches all over the place. <laughs> but uh, yeah, soon enough they will all look like this, which is pretty cool. You actually see some progress in the game, you know. So, okay, let's uh, head over to the throne room where we can find uh, Monk and uh, Adam's father, King Gregor. Or what's left of him, at least. Yeah, let's skip this bunch as well, because we've seen it. And uh, our inventory has uh, shrunken quite considerably uh, with all those birds' nests uh, gone. Which I don't mind at all, because the scrolling of the inventory doesn't really work. And there's Monk and the uh, sarcophagus with the king in it, I suppose, which looks kind of tiny. Your father's body. Take the hunting horn. It is yours now. We must carry the body to the embalmers, Adam. I will guide you to them. Right, that's some kind of tradition that's in here. Now your father's body will be carried to the embalmers. We will follow you there. And I think you actually go there automatically, or do we need to... Uh, no, we need to actually go to the uh, entrance. Okay. No problem. Luckily, that's pretty quick, at least. So, let's head out and go to the embalmers. And this is another part, uh, pretty story heaven in the game. And I do like it again. I just love the uh, story of the game. It never lo loses uh, focus much uh, either. It all makes kind of sense, you know. So, with his companions by his side, Adam took his father's body across the desert of Rahasa to the cave of the embalmers. What? Not the desert of doom? <laughs> <laughs> and uh, with sense, I mean, the actually things, the big things in the storyline make sense. I mean, not the uh, details like uh, using a flute to build citadels and singing for triceratops. That kind of doesn't, but the other stuff does, you know. So off we go. And that's a, a lot of dinosaurs for one sarcophagus, but oh well. This looks kind of neat. And yeah, sorry again for the uh, little weird lines in the recording. That's just my card crapping out. The actual game looks very fluid. But it just doesn't display it uh, that well on the computer anymore. Wow, this scene is actually pretty long. <laughs> well, we should be almost there now. Here we are, and I think it's best to go in here the next time, because, uh, yeah, there's quite a bit of story going on. So, uh, until then guys, take care, and see you later.